All right, guys, welcome back to Card Magic 6. And today I got another package here from SoCal Playing Cards. I did a, another, uh, I did an unboxing from them a few weeks ago, I think, or a month ago, two months ago, on the Fontaines from their bargain bin. And another bargain bin came up and I got myself a Split Spades Blue Edition deck. Um, it's, yeah, it's a Blue Split Spades, uh, Blue Split Spades deck. And I'm not sure if it's the first or Lions Edition. Uh, I will I check. I actually don't know which one it is, so I will see when I open it up. Most likely it's a Lions edition because I know first editions are hard to get it uh, to find. Yeah. So anyway, uh, any other? Uh, let's just get into it straight away. Here we go. So I use my Exacto knife as usual. Pretty sure this should be much easier to open than most of my other packages. All right. There's more tape. <laughs> yep, so that should be it. Okay. So in here, we have bubble wrapping, of course. Receipt, I'm pretty sure. And then in here, there is a deck. I can feel it really bubble wrapped in here. Okay, so let's open it up, see what it is. He gives extra bubble wrap for some reason. I don't know why he does that, but that's what Henry does, which is nice because I can use this later if I'm shipping out decks. So anyway, as uh, I open these up, here they are. Ooh, wow. Beautiful. Yeah, so, some, um, I'm not sure what this is. I'm guessing just styrofoam. Yeah, so, he sends a thank you card as well, and uh, here it is, here's the deck. This is the Blue Split Spades by David Blaine. So, big deck, yeah. Um, it's a blue seal, as you can see in here. It comes in a DS1 sleeve, which is nice. I'll kind of take it out, actually. Yep, it comes in a nice DS1 carry uh, case sleeve to protect it, so we got that. And it's uh, sealed perfectly. Uh, there's, I think, a minor dent that was noticed uh, somewhere. I clearly I can't even see it. Yeah, I can't even see it. But anyway, <laughs> uh, on the bottom, it shows first edition. So this is a first edition blue split spades. Yeah. So pretty crazy. I only paid about 25 bucks for this one plus shipping. Um, so it came out to 34 US dollars. And that's not bad for... Um, a blue split space, ones that you haven't seen in stores in years, you know. Uh, you can kind of pick these up in certain spots. Now, most people who are going to pick up split spades um, will most likely keep them in their collection sealed. I'm going to open these up right here so you guys get to see them. Because uh, I've always wanted a split spade deck, so this is definitely something I've been waiting for. So these ones are not the same kind of cello wrapped. Um, these ones are actually, there's no tab like to pull up or to pull on. Like these are the um, the blue sealed ones. So I'm guessing they were made in Cincinnati. Uh, I don't see anything here. So we'll go into it. I'll just open it up. Really don't care about the cello. Yep, so that was pretty easy to open up. So here it is. This is it. So I'll go ahead and break the seal. Yeah, I'm really happy to get my hands on a split spade, for sure. There are silvers, I think, available still. Uh, there's obviously the gold split spades, which are available in a lot of stores. All right, so let's get into it. So on the tab, it says something. I think it says on by one or off by one or something like that. I can't read it here. Uh, the seal's covering it. Ooh, this, this looks weird inside the deck. I'll just take these out. This this looks like it's a stripper deck or something. Nope, that's just me. All right. <laughs> yeah, so once you get into the cards, here they are. Wow, so let's see what we get. Uh, on the top, we have... Oh, I'm guessing this comes in the Monica stack. That's right, yeah. So this has to be... If I spread it out... Yeah, this comes in the Monica stack. The uh, Juan Tomri's... Stack, yeah. So this is the, I gotta check it out how to use a mnemonic stack. If you guys know how it works, 
Uh, let me know in the comments because I have no clue how it's supposed to. I'm going to leave it in this order. I'm not going to mess it up. I know you're supposed to move a certain card to the front or something. I'm not sure, but I will check it out as well if I can. Uh, but anyway, close it up to spread. You get uh, two identical jokers from the split spades, which I expected. Wow, I'm surprised there's a lot of like paper coming out. These are like fresh, right? So, yup. So yeah, such a beautiful deck, oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, so here you get two identical jokers. Uh, I'm not sure exactly how it looks. It's like a clown face, but also pictures of Blaine. And there's a lot of other imagery going on here on the crown. You see his symbols, or his logo, sorry. Yep, um, what else? Yeah, just Blaine kind of doing a packet trick or a card trick or something. He's got like four cards as the teeth down here. Yeah, and then he's got uh, faces of some of the court cards on the bottom here. Yep, and then, yeah, there's like an eye for the clown where you'll pick up another person there. Not sure who that is, but anyway, yeah, there's a lot going on. Uh, those are the jokers and yeah for the rest of the deck it's in uh the monica stack that's how it comes uh, i heard about that each split spade deck comes with something special this one comes with the monica stack black one comes with a double backer and the red one comes with a uh, card that looks like this i'm pretty sure on the front so pretty nice um pretty nice deck i'm not going to complain uh, of course, most people wouldn't open these up because of how limited they are. But I've always wanted to get um, a blue split spade. Now, you can get some of these off of his store, but they're the stripper deck version. So they're not going to be the exact same. You can't really perform with them. They're not the first edition, so they're not that great. But they, you know, they look the same. And uh, probably handle the same as well. I'm not sure exactly because these are the blue seal ones. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that unboxing. Um, let me know if you want me to uh, do a further deck review on this deck, you know, card handling and all that kind of stuff if you want me because I just got it, so I still have to break it in a bit. But if you want me to do a deck review on any decks I own or this one or anything else, let me know in the comments. Um, but that's it for today, and I'll see you in another video. Bye.